man, if only we had a time machine and a di dimensional displacement machine so we could make this battle happen. See, Gilgamesh down below is the king of Uruk. And if you don't know, he is two thirds divine, one third human. So he's got a lot of divine God. So basically more powerful than your average demon God, right? Or your average demigod. Now, Hellboy, of course, is pure demon who's been raised among humans. Now, both of them have a lot of the same power set in that they're strong, they're fast, they've got great reflexes. Um, Gilgamesh, I know, has got some blessed or divine weapons, whereas Hellboy's got a, a gun with some very large bullets, right? But he's fought some very powerful creatures. Now, my heart tends to tell me that Hellboy comes out with this fight. But killing a divine being, man, we haven't seen him do that. But he's killed everything else, right? So I'm going with Hellboy right now based on the initial, you know, initial screening. But I may dig deeper in this in a live and we'll have a discussion about this.